I'm back. Yep. There we go. Uh, <coughs> pardon. Hello everyone, wel yeah. Hello everyone and welcome aboard. I'll be your Captain Hillian uh, today along with... Please have my Lieutenant here at your service, along with two crispy burgers. <laughs> and welcome back to Enslaved Odyssey to the West. And yeah, I, I, <laughs> I keep... I, yeah, I'm so used now to most games working well with the uh, borderless gaming thing that I forget which games I do need to be, well, I do need to treat differently, like this one, which needs to run through a DX window for it to, well, fit well, not for it to work well windowed modes, because Borderless just does not work with this game for some reason. And yeah, last time we got started on this game, and uh, yeah, we play as Monkey, who, uh, well, needs to escort Trip over there, back to her home tribe after they got raided by slavers. <clears throat> How are we going to get across there? Oh no. We've got company. Let me scan. And yeah, we need to redo a little bit since we didn't hit the checkpoints. No, we didn't hit any checkpoints closer to where we left okay. off. It has a flaw. If you can damage its inner core, it'll self-destruct. <clears throat> okay. Yeah. Don't think we saw that last time. Uh. Mouse escaped from the game there. It should stay stuck inside. Okay. It seems I've forgotten a bit of the control. Okay, why is the... Why is the mouse getting out of the game? It should not be able to. Anyways, there we go. How Monkey doesn't get hurt by that, uh, we'll never know. <laughs> okay, what? Why is the Gnouse escaping from it? Let me see, can I put up a quick adjustment on this? Uh, let me see. Mouse. Let's see, key cursor within window. We didn't have this before, so I don't know what's causing the difference now. I wasn't playing with the with the controller last time, I think. Hmm. Yeah, I think you used the controller last time. Yeah, I, I don't think I did. Hmm. I think I need to read. I think I need to restart the game quickly for it to recognize the the bit about keeping the mouse captured to the window. Uh, uh, okay, it wanted me to click the button, not click on the thing on screen. Okay, so this will just be a quick restart then. Yeah, I feel like if you use controllers, but I think I remember seeing the Xbox controller uh, suggestions that here and there. Mm -hmm. Actually, did I? Actually, oh, yes, I was using the controller. Okay, now I remember. Yeah, okay. Well, good thing I have that thing right in front of me here as well, behind my keyboard. So, yeah. <laughs> I'm just being an idiot, as usual. Okay. Yeah, is it going to respond? Yes, it is. Okay. <laughs> well. All right. Do with, I this, uh, the with this... With yeah. this... Yeah, correct it then. It's yeah, we can skip these. Yeah. Okay, let me get a few for things again then. I still can't see. 
Mm. Jag kan disconcede the game. Uh, Okej. Okay. Do you get it in the wrong pixel again or something? Mm. Oh, that. There, there we go. Oh, there we go. Now I can see us again. Okay, I forgot to put the uh, preview window on, always on top. Okay, yeah, now I've got the controls again a bit. Okay. <laughs> Third time we'll be seeing this now. Okay, and... <laughs> Somehow missed both of them. There we go. Okay. No. Let's move on then. Yeah, we don't need to fight those. So we can just skip those. And instead, actually, we'll need to help Trip get across here. Yep. Okay, there we go. I don't think you can accidentally throw her into the depths, but it would be pretty hilarious. Now I expect you to learn that at the worst time moment, I just get angry for it instead. <laughs> like you're three meters away from a checkpoint and you accidentally throw her off a cliff. <laughs> Yeah, it would be rather rage-inducing, but also pretty hilarious. Depends. Like, if you have to redo 30 minutes action, that would probably piss you off a lot. I don't think there's that much time between each part with this. Hopefully not. But it's still an accident. There are games where you almost have to replay 30... Actually, I think... Worst case, I, think, I don't know which game this was in, but... This had a lot of checkpoints. And one of them was, well, yeah, the checkpoint was basically um, on one section, almost one hour back. Okay, that's just plain could... bad design. Yeah, I don't think you could manually save the seat as well. But it's was case of uh, you easily forgot or something uh, at times, or you need special areas to save in. Okay. There we go. Let's go. Okay. Now, where are you? All the way over there. Okay, here you come. <laughs> okay, I do like that it also just zooms in on her and doesn't just point in a general direction or something. Also, this outline when she is behind something. Also useful. Okay. Is that a banana tree? Looks a bit like it, or at least it's a tropical-ish thing. So I'm guessing the temperature overall has gone up. Yeah, it has gone up. Yeah, and bloody heck, it's shocked with me today. No, I... I... Oh. All right. Another dog. We better move. Yeah, this is where we had to call it off last time. Okay. Why do we get the feeling that the moment we walk through the door there, it's going to say checkpoint? Ooh. I would not decide that. Right, I would say, it, it, it seems to be really shopping for me, but... I suspect that people downstairs are watching a series again on Netflix or some other site. That's okay. rather lightly demanding. Let's see. Monkey! I'm over here! We'll have to meet up further down the bridge. 
Okay, yeah, no way we're getting together with this distance between us. Careful, monkey. Long way down. I think we can see that ourselves, yeah. Oh, yeah, from that height, the water will hurt. Yeah, if, if you hit water badly from a, a terminal velocity, Wait, yeah, you're going to splat. Because at that speed, the surface tension is more like concrete than fluid. Yeah. Up ahead. I can't get past. Damn! A turret! Monkey! The turret! Take it out first! Okay. Gotta get to it without waking up the other mechs. Because they'd probably be line for trip. Wait for the shield to recharge a bit. Okay. It underneath its firing line. Uh, okay, nothing in here. I don't remember this game having collectibles or anything of the like. It just comes straight through. Okay. <laughs> Time for this again. Great monkey. Let's get out of here. Okay, can you pick those up as you go? <laughs> okay. Yep. Well, she actually does, sort of. <laughs> okay. Or where's from the kills? Oh well. Hey. Are you okay? Yeah. It's another glitch. Let's just keep moving. He just can't resist grabbing those, huh? Even though it, he knows they confuse the fuck out of him. Monkey see, monkey grab. Let's see. This is all very cobbled together. Hmm. The crash site. We're nearly there. Okay, I suspect we're probably not going to be the only ones there, though. Since, well, it flew over half the city and the crashed for the other half. Place. We're gonna have a hard time getting past. Wait, <clears throat> that vehicle. Maybe we can get it going. Oh, yeah. How? There's no way. We have a power cell, remember? Okay. And, um, yeah. <laughs> Looks like this place, uh. Oop. You do gotta wonder when were these turrets set up? Yeah. I must have lost that. Because if they were set up early, they were probably meant for a security hey. checkpoint or something. Hey. This way. Hey. Hey. There's no cover up ahead. Uh, okay, get the hatch open. Okay. Now, let's have a little look at this thing. I don't remember this at all. Come on, put your back into it.
Of course, he gets to enjoy the okay. seats. I'm engaging the power cell. Let me, let me try to... Damn! The circuits are all burnt out! Okay, okay. I'll just see if I can... Oh, yes! The drive system still works. Okay, monkey, get in. Oops. Whoops! Hey, hey, hey! Oh, crap. <laughs> of course, she doesn't have a driver's license. And again, nobody has needed one in like 200 years. Sorry. She's just fumbling around in there. This is not going to last long. Damn it. Ow. I'm trying to keep you safe is hard enough, but if you're gonna go out of your way to kill us both. Monkey! Calm down, look where we are! The crash site! This is where the slave ship crashed. Now it must have been the other ship that crashed here. We made it! Uh, not the only one. Oh no. Good job, you scared it. Gonna have to fight it. Is this very same damn one or is it? Okay, stun it how is the question. Oh, so that thing is re absolutely relentless, <laughs> isn't it? If it is the same one. I think I mentioned a uh, different one. Uh, let's see, how do we switch? Yeah, we switch ammo. Okay. If we get too far away, it'll go after the trip. Okay, just stun it that way. Okay, just wait on it while it's down. Now that we're doing that much damage. So, hello, and goodbye. Well, stun them is better than none. Yeah. Oh, so that thing that Trip is in looks more like it's uh, an APC of sorts than a, a normal car. A very small one at that, but still. It might be that sense. It was able to handle church fire. Uh, it looked more armored than just a civilian car. Yeah, it could have been a, a VIP transport, maybe. It definitely was a lot more different than the other cars we've seen around the place. Yeah. So, plus the little the dish up I top and such and viewfinder or something. Um, the way it's built, it, it looks more military. Yeah. I got a armored uh, personnel carrier. That's what APC stands for, right? Yep. I just realized that now when you said it. <laughs> For some reason. See, get moving. Okay. I gotta say, with how every, how most everything in this place is scrap made, I find it a bit, <laughs> I find it a bit, uh, well, fitting that I left on the the mech helmet. Oh yeah, I noticed it, and I didn't even bother saying it before, I kinda like it still. <laughs> and yeah, it does not fit the stream. Okay, one or two more should do it. Mm -hmm. 
Okay, come on. Get one more. Bye-bye. Okay, this would have been more challenging without the upgrades and everything. Though I don't really remember if the boss fights in this game are that much to uh, talk about anyways. Oh, uh, oh, hello. Now we're the chaser, huh? Yep. It's self-repairing. Yeah, it won't repair that, though. <laughs> and of course the fucker has a second health bar. I think he could just... With more time than we allow. Yeah, it would need to be out of combat to do the repairs, not mid-combat repair. Okay, get some distance. Is that people, some people need to sometimes uh, remember. Some things it makes sense to be able to do need combat to repair men that are such. And some things you, you just can't do in the middle of a combat or too close to a combat area. Yeah, because there's a, just the risk of you just the collateral around the fight. Yeah, just too much of a risk. Okay, one more should do it. Also, this thing looks a lot less scrapped together than the uh, the other mechs. So, yeah, I think this thing, this is an original or mostly original uh, military. There, yeah, military yeah. units. Oh, yeah. cool. For else, some piece that looks scrapped. Is like his teeth look scrapped. Oh. <laughs> okay, he just flipped the fucker over on himself. Without her scan, he wouldn't know what the hell to do against it. Is that another dog hand? And okay, that's a big one there. Real big one. <laughs> that was not the time to be tripping. Okay, I thought she meant head to the big metal arm sticking out of the ground, but no. <laughs> Take that. <clears throat> Village, Village approach. approach. Uh, really? <laughs> At this rate, we'll reach my community by midday. What will you 
do when we get there? After I take the headband off. Apart from break my neck, I mean. Go back, I guess. Go back where? Wherever. Depends where I can find food and fuel. I, I usually keep moving. You could probably stay if you wanted. I'm just saying, when my father hears about all you've done for me, I know he'll offer you a home. If that's what you want. Something I'll need to check later, because I think the headband is actually upside down from what we saw on the... <laughs> the poor guy we saw melted. Stop here! Stop here, stop here, this is it! Uh, he's not. We can't go any further on the bike, it'll trigger the defense systems. Oh. My father can be a little weird about strangers, so just so just let me do all the talking when we get there, okay? Okay. Oh, that's strange. What? Why have the security gates been activated? So how do we get in? Let's keep going to the lookout post. We just need to find a radio and they'll let us in. Follow me, monkey. Hey, either way, it does look a lot like a crown the way it uh, is now, huh? Yeah, do it does cover here. most of his forehead. Mark is in here. And he should be operating the bridge. Come yeah, on. if it was upside uh, down, it will Mark. be inside his skull. Mark! Anyone? Monkey, the bridge controls are up there. Okay. I'll find a way around. Okay. Trouble in paradise, it looks. It seems like. Yeah, Monkey did say what was the slavers to... Well, what was to stop them from coming back again, huh? Yeah. Great. Now lower the bridge for me. Okay. So I'm pretty sure in the in Journey to the West or Journey okay. to the East, I forget Let's what going. the original book, the story was called. Yeah, I think it was also a horse, but I think we we can all agree that the metal steed like that is much more preferable. It's so good to be home. I can't wait to see my father again. Yeah, Would they be any other companions? Uh, I won't tell. Why not just have turrets and guns? It's all Mark's design. He just has a thing about raising and lowering bridges. So we let him get on with it. <laughs> okay. okay. We gotta get up there. Well, at least it keeps uh, the in and out flow under control ish. Okay, uh, there we go. And one person would not be able to get past this, but well, when you do have multiple people, it would still slow them the hell down, but they would get past it. Yeah, at least I feel like they should be on a ladder there or something. Wait, there's a control here. Okay. <laughs> then we just lower that. And there we go. <clears throat> oh, my foot still feels weird. 
I'm not getting sick. Just earlier, I had a, took a little tablet for my Sorry. mouth. There's no one here either. Oh well. So, throw me up there. I was to say, it says I have a bit of dry mouth. However, when I took one, my mouth decided it is time to sneeze. So I tried to prepare for it, but before I could move it, the p tablet aside, I almost choked on it. I've had it at one point uh, that I had one of those tablets go down the wrong way, and that was very unpleasant. Yeah, it didn't go down, but I could feel it was, you know, that close. I was able to, even with the sneeze, prevent it from doing so, but... Uh. Oh, of course, couldn't be that easy. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. <sighs> what the hell is that? I don't know. That should never happen. It must have been damaged somehow. I think we can take a guess as to how it might have been damaged. Because all of this started because the whole trip was <clears throat> caught by slavers who raided the place. And, well... Without it, maintenance work... Come on, get in. There's the watchtower. More bridges. Are these really necessary? <laughs> Bring it up with Mark when you see him. He says that they're a perfect way to keep the mechs away, because it takes human intelligence to figure them out. But we think he just likes bridges. <laughs> uh, he, pro he probably played the hell out of games like Bridge Constructor and such. Hmm. Okay, pull it. The he might sort of maybe be right? Yeah, they could probably figure it out through trial and error. Yeah. It, it would depend on what kind of AI you gave in the uh, robot to begin with. Mark finds that kind of thing hypnotic. Trip. Yes? That's enough about Mark. And Bridges. <laughs> okay. Now... Okay, we use this, then we can go across again, lower this side, and then we'll be set. Yep, okay, come on over. Yeah, I think pick a military uh, robot may struggle, especially when you can, uh, well, Almost like the uh, arms tower. for it. There's yeah. Someone posted. Like, Whatever's going on. Let me also say, if it was just a noble bridge, they would understand that pull down, bridge go down. But these bridge designs were probably cause of issues for those AI. Yeah. But, yeah, this is not normal. Impossible. The posts are always manned. Uh, Trip, I think you're overlooking a few things. Come in, this is post nine. Come in, base. Are you reading me? Over. Base, come in. What's going on? What's going on? Trip. No, no. No. Trip. Trip! Wait, wait! Oh, great. <laughs> You're a mix, mix. Gotta get to the watchtower. 
Okay, and hope that Triv doesn't get herself killed. Okay, maybe he's got a clue. Oh, it clearly means me. There was a sign of the, that earlier. Yeah. There was too damaged to see what was on it. I guess that is the old really blue bots are busy being quote unquote wild. Have we. May have a, a bit. Actually, control some steel is going over the pyramids. These things charging with their banshee screams. Not going to help them. <laughs> okay, that's just not. <laughs> that is just not going to be cool. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's a stunner. Okay, you have something wrong with you, though. And ow. Alright, yeah, the, the, the AOE stun. Okay, let's just finish these off. <laughs> there we go. Oh, oh, come on, even more. Stun the shield one. Okay. This should... <laughs> this should pace things through the wall. Okay. Yet more... This one doesn't have... Okay, this one isn't vulnerable like the other one. Okay. Yep. No, you don't. Okay, you do don't. <laughs> there. <laughs> okay. Trip, I can't hear you! Gonna be quick before she, well, runs into the mechs and we have to start this game all over again because she gets herself captured again. That sounds very, very specific. This is quite a place, though. Isolated Ooh, yeah. and quite large as well. Watchtower. Shit. More pyramid mechs. Late. Okay. Okay. Yep. Even more. Okay. Yep. I would have liked it if we could have thrown these off of the cliff. But oh well. <laughs> okay, did, did we just did we just tear its head out through its ass? Maybe what we should pay for. No more. I get more shockiness during the combat scenes. Probably because the combats probably are more than 30 FPS. Probably. Oop. Okay, then. Where, where did you come from? Um, hmm. I think I put in the. Yeah, I, I'm pretty sure I put in a fix before we started with the game. I'm coming, Trap. To make it run at 60 FPS instead of a limited 30. God damn it. Uh, Maybe for streaming it would have been better to keep it at 30 then, yeah. Weird. All the times it's told me what the PS you've been showing me. Ah! 
Oh yeah. Yeah, it says uh not the PS. Yeah, that's specifically with Discord though, since that's the limiter on it. For 60 I need to pay for Nitro, and Nitro is not worth it in my opinion. Ah, uh, okay, okay, so nothing we can fix that. Okay! Trip, I'm nearly there! Yeah, yeah that, and that can feel like... They should get allow us 60 PS, then if you want 120, then your case you can pay for it. Oh, stunner. Okay, I'll deal with the unshielded first then. Okay. Good thing its aim is absolutely terrible. <laughs> okay. Be gone, you. Okay, we didn't <laughs> pull it out through its chest plate, <laughs> not its ass. <laughs> Close enough. Poor lady. I'm guessing everyone they couldn't take or resisted too much to be worth the fight, they killed. So how exactly... They didn't use flamethrowers or this place would be completely incinerated already, so do they have laser weapons? Or a different kind of fire weapon? Trap! Or... My father... My father, I have to find him. Okay, she is a bit too distressed. Can we have electricity do that to a human body? Uh, in absolutely extreme measures, I'm guessing, but that wouldn't account for the area around them being charred as well. Or then it probably would be uh, some kind of flame uh, fire weapon. Give me that. <laughs> now the monkey has a gun. Okay, anyone else? Okay. This looks way too much like an arena. Someone must be alive. Trip, you have to slow down. You. And there's another one over there. Where'd she run off to? This is where she came from, wasn't it? Oh no. Okay, we really gotta get to her before she does get herself killed, because she's in no uh, mind to, well, 
keep her own safety in mind. Presume that some of these bits are caused by damage from the slaver attack. Okay, great. Okay, apparently this does a lot more damage than I thought it would do. <laughs> Who's shotting these things? Okay, yeah. If that makes it well, a lot more useful than I thought it'd be. Well, I guess it is really be worthwhile to upgrade it then. Okay, there's yeah, one more. That'll be useful for, yeah, for thinning out the herds. Okay, it had one last jump in it. Okay. Open up. Oh shit, they must have barricaded the gate. Okay. Gotta clear it or somehow. not. Uh, let's see. I'm guessing we just have to shoot it. Because we had, to, like, we had to shoot the uh, support struts yeah. back in the city. The barricade from up here. <laughs> Even monkey agrees on that. Okay. Where the hell are you, Trip? Oh no, I can't find anyone. Yeah, at this rate, she is. She is likely to trip and kill herself somehow. Okay. Just one of you? No, of course, it's not just one of you. Um, there you go. Okay, let's see if this works. Uh, of course, they're splitting up. Oh well, still got them all. Okay. Holy. Yeah, I'm guessing Monkey doesn't get hurt from that because he has that shield on him, which pro you know, protects him from well, shrapnel. Is there anyone left? Trip, can't you hear me? Just, just stay where you are. Yeah, I don't think anything is going to convince you to stay still at the moment, Monkey. Okay, that could have ended badly. Everything's gonna be okay, Trip. Do you hear me? Uh, even if she can, well, physically hear you, I don't think she is uh, mentally present enough to hear you, Monkey. No clue what that circle above the, the first one was there. Yeah. Oh. I don't think we would have been able to get in range for a takedown on them, though. Exactly where you are. I'm coming to get you. Okay. I, I just, I've just been relying on the, uh, the button prompt to tell me when, when they're vulnerable to takedown. Oh. 
stunning. <laughs> okay. To, to define something. Just stun 75 enemies. <laughs> okay. Well, no takedown for this one. Okay. Yeah, they've got a lot of stun ammo around here. Okay. Which way to progress? No. Yeah, it's a gunner, not a turret. Ah, here. Okay. Let's see. That way for health. Okay, where is that? There you are. Yep. Watching the completely wrong way. Uh, wait. Another dead end. Okay. Ah. Where would where would platforming heroes be without just bars sticking out of everywhere? If I get around, huh? <laughs> okay. Hmm. Oop. Uh. Wait. Yep. Okay. How do they get behind us? Where's there's another one? Uh, it, it, monkey. There. Okay, for some reason he didn't want to jump there. Okay, one more. I'm guessing this is just a case of kill them all when the gate will open somehow. Or... Ah, now we can use it. Okay. Luckily, those stun attacks don't actually, well, disable our shield or anything. Not that, not that the shield is any use in melee, anyways. As we're getting shot at. There we go. Smash it so hard it phases through the wall. Okay, that's a bunch of them. Trip, wherever you are, just keep your head down. I'm coming. Yep. Yeah. Okay, with how much ammo there's thrown around here. Yep, yep. This is probably how we're expected to deal with this. Not sure if we can even get up there. No, we freaking don't. Damn, they're everywhere. Okay, gotta keep in mind that the stun shot does have a bit of travel time. 
There we go. He managed to snipe its shoulder. Okay, is that? Yep. Yeah. Nope, that's not all. Hello. Um, <laughs> You're a big one. What the hell is that? Hey, monkey. Okay, this thing is quick as well. Not quick enough to dodge that, though. Okay. Nice try. Yep. And of course, there's going to be more. Stop blocking. Okay, here we go again. No, no, you freaking... No phones in the city square. Or village square. Yep. I was about to say I could hear another one, but I can't see. And then, of course, it bites me in the freaking ass. Freaking controller disconnected. Let me guess. Batteries. Uh, and that is why I always keep spare batteries around. So, there and there. I I'm always tiny. forget which end is the plus and minus on these things. So it's a good thing that they're marked. Okay. You two go in the charger. I thought the plus side was usually the one with the sort of a lack of term. Do I think this is actually the term, the nipple? Yes. <laughs> uh, let's see. Got to put that thing there. Okay. Batteries are charging. These have enough charge. Okay. Any more? Trip. Okay, Trip, I'm coming. Yep, yep. Yeah, she's that way. Okay. Uh, up ah, there. Okay. Yeah, she is probably having a quite a bit of a breakdown. survivors could have retreated to. There are not going to be any survivors. We don't know that. The war room, maybe. Okay. Okay. Show me. Here. 
gaining access. Oh, he is so sorry for her. Security door is still intact. Dad. You're right. There must be survivors. The door can only be locked from the inside. Okay, so how do we get it open? Come on, follow me. Okay, so there is still hope. At least someone is still alive. Hey, 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 where are you going? If we remove the restrictors on the wind turbines, it will create a power surge. The electronic locks in the main hall will overload, shut down, be forced to reboot. While they're rebooting, I'll override them. Yeah, yeah, but will, will that work? Yes, follow me. We need to get the yeah. power up to about 1500 kilowatts. I hope the generators weren't damaged in the attack. Yes, yes, they're okay. This is gonna work. Is it running low amount of uh, watts? The big windmill. That's where we're going. The the big windmill, you can definitely current. say, yeah. Fry if you touch them. We need to find another way. We could cross the bridge underneath. Let's see. <clears throat> I'm blanking at the moment if megawatts and kilowatts, uh, which of the two are bigger. But it is still a quite a bit of power, I believe. Okay, yeah, I think megawatts is bigger than kilo. Looks like the walkway has been raised. There's a lever for controlling it there. You can reach it by climbing around. Yeah, of course. <laughs> okay. Stand a bit of parkour to just get around a simple obstacle. I'm not gonna live in this area. <laughs> Yeah, quick. Let me guess why. <laughs> the, the fact that the place is falling apart on top of being oh, well, made out of scrap. Now use the lever and lower the walkway. Yeah. I don't understand. Why do the slavers do this, monkey? What do Pyramid want? Right now, let's just focus on getting you to your father. I think the answer is uh, as much as it's not liked, because they can. Okay. Up Throw you me go. Up to that window. I can make it to the top from there. You'll need to make your own way up. Okay. Yeah, monkey having to make his own way. Whoa. What else is new, huh? Okay. Just hold it together, Trip. We're gonna do this. Thanks, monkey. Yeah, it's not that she bounced back so easily. It's that she she managed to bottle things up for the moments okay damn more mix well, at least I get it will we'll be able to get through once we short the power okay just leave them to me Okay. We need to open the sails and get it moving. Fast. I'll use the dragonfly to show you what we need to do. Will this really capture wind? You should be able to climb up the back. 
Yes. We'll have to pull down each sail to get it turning. Let's go. And these are just the spokes, not the actual sails, as he says. Okay. Hmm. I'm guessing they, they probably uh, pulled the sails in to avoid them getting damaged. That makes sense. That actually makes sense. And it could be that it got too windy or such. Because, well, let's be honest. If this place were to... Just, <laughs> if this place were to get some really strong winds, it would probably just pull the entire building off the ridge. Okay. There. Just looking around for the sparkle. But not the sparkle, the shine, shimmer, whatever you want to call it. You go here. Wait, okay, what? Okay. But we need more Did power. It... Can you open the other sails? You can't access the other sails from the top. Uh, typically, sails aren't made from Should metal, though. But well, also, uh, yeah, uh, yeah, you, modern you windmills. Like, yeah, do modern windmills have a specific design that are propeller shaped? Hmm. These are not exactly that shape per se. Now they're somewhat, but not the best, but then again, in a world like this, could you ever end up making the best possible thing at such a scale? Like the smaller windmills, they function perfectly fine I like that. So you can jump on. Just tell me when. Yeah. Stop it now. Do I get, guessing thought oh, this is both wind and the weight of the propellers themselves? Start her up. Releasing brakes. If that makes sense. Okay. Like, uh, they give each weight uh, of the propellers give it a some sort of momentum. Possibly, along with the uh, wind pushing it along. Uh, yeah. How do I? Do? So I guess it is more of a combination of momentum and wind. Uh, again, I'm not an engineer, so I could be completely wrong. Yeah. Hmm. Okay, I think we need to get to the other side, because the bar here is way too high. Monkey. There we go. Intermediary step. Hmm. Can we get... Okay. Start it back up. Guess there's just a little bit too... <laughs> a little bit too few space here. There. Uh, oh. It's just going to send us back. Hmm. Okay, so we do have to make it across from there. Okay. Okay, then how are we to... I can't just make a jump for it as they pass. There's something here I'm missing, I think. It's not a grabbable point. There's no grabbable point there either. Stop it. There's absolutely no way that we should be able to reach that with a jump. We can't. Wait. Okay, I don't think we can climb over there. Hmm. Okay, the game has me stumped for a bit here as to what the hell to actually do. Same. 
Uh, we know what to do, but not how to. Hmm. Is there really nothing over this way? Or am I just messing up the timing or such? Okay, move it. No, I... I think Monkey should be able to jump that distance. But the fact that it's moving is preventing that, I think. Or... Hmm. Let's leave them running for the moment. Like she said we can't reach the others from the top, but maybe we can get back onto the bar on the top. Um. And from there, jump to one of the platforms. Why not do it from the bottom? It does seem to reach ground level with each propeller. Yeah, but probably not high enough. You were saying. Hit the brakes. If not. That that is too high for us to reach the ground uh, up from the ground. And right. it looks like you can yeah. reach it, it, it from the red building. Okay, and it's become unclimbable here it seems. Okay, go. Stop it now. Can you really not just climb these other ones? No. Hmm. Also, full health. Are you Another full that? health restore. Have you hmm. done any upgrades in a while? Uh, no. So we can take a look at that in a bit. Hmm. Okay, seriously, how do... Like, the camera was pointing towards here. I'm pretty sure if this... Or is this where we're supposed to... Uh, oh. Were we just getting the wrong one each time? I will not be surprised. Okay, move it. Okay, why is the one that's open closer than the others? Hold it there. Okay. okay move, move it, it again. And we should be able to jump up on this one here. Yeah, there we go. All right, so I was ready to u use this red one uh, to jump the, to there. Oh, I, I think I see it. What? It breaks. It's okay. You can't get a good view from this point, but it looks like the bar with these ones is in the middle, whilst with the first one it's at the front of the uh, top here. So uh, that's why it was in reach and the others weren't. At the sign floor? Mm. We're starting to draw a crowd. We'll need to do the last one too. Okay, this causing these to speed up. That was well timed. Okay, move it. Okay. Yep. The thing is speeding up since what's well, catching more wind and such. I was going to say something easy. earlier about uh, this being a bad place for the thing, but there's actually, except for that windmill, I think it has a clear view in the front of itself, at least. Because if it were lower to the ground, those buildings would be blocking the airflow. Yeah. Also, That's... it looks like the solar machine is steam powered. Hmm. It Stop breaks. it. Okay, yeah. For s you can see it now with the. Actually, no, what? Wait. Is it just placed differently on different ones? Because this one isn't open. 
Okay, yeah. The... So I just was having it wrong. For a moment, I thought the bars were moving on the ones that were opened. That they moved to the mid, yeah, to the front. But no, that one is still in the middle, and we can't really see the other one at the moment. But that one should be at the front as well. Hit the brakes. It's in yeah. You can see it over there against the. Uh, against the reds that one is up front it's just for some reason that one has the <clears throat> has the bar in the middle instead of at the front okay we're all set be careful on your way down monkey okay oh yeah that is <laughs> that is definitely some mauling speed huh uh yeah, and she's not at the controls anymore. Okay, no easy ways through this time. Almost got clobbered there. Okay. okay. I'm gonna trigger the power search. Get back to the gate. Ready for when those mechs come through. Okay. Okay, I'm all set. Monkey, here comes the power surge. You ready? Oh yeah. Do it. Let's just hope this doesn't cause more damage than we intend. If you could just jump over, why didn't you do this before? But they are mech though, so you could probably, uh, you know, jump, lightning jump through two there if they try to jump over it. Yeah, arcing over two. Really high. There are probably self-preservation systems that prevented it from even attempting in case it came short. Possibly. Just these things don't really have the brain power to be that smart. Okay, okay keep you up off my back. I'm guessing these things are the original models or such, and that the the smaller ones are more uh, yes, more scavenged, scrapped together versions. Possibly. I mean, all the ones that look more the nice look like uh, they had a clear design or whatever. Definitely made for something more modern, but it mean like it wasn't with the bl massive blades. Well, those are the ones that were. Ah! Oh. Yeah. Oops, no, you don't. There we go. I, I guess you, you can see the ones that I do fit in with the others uh, exactly in the sign. Yeah. Come on, give up. There we go. Okay, let's hope that we get to the door we before the mechs do. Door. We should be able to get it open when the system reboots. Okay. Okay, so if we ended up being the cause of death for the people still left inside, I think Trip will not take that well in any <laughs> in any possible way. I think you're right on that. I 
hope this works. It will. Okay, airlock to hide the loading. System's powering down. Dog, where did that come from? You go ahead. I'll deal with it. Uh, of course. Yep, a, a, a dog with guns. Okay, well, at least we know how to take you down now. If I can I get the shots. I think the dogs might sort of be. I think they're all um, more, 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 uh, designed from the past, but modified. Probably, yeah. The whole chief up looks off. Hmm. Then again, they could just be made that way to cause as much damage as possible. Because, well, a jagged tooth is going to cause more damage than a smooth one. Uh, hello. Uh, okay. <laughs> monkey refused to do there for a moment. So, so monkey see, monkey not do. Yeah, but do remember him. Having so many mismatched in teeth will make it a very annoying thing to mass produce for. Keep it out. Okay. Keep beating on the thing. Bye bye. Yeah, we have more than plenty of stun ammo. Yeah, I guess they are like the ones with the blades, like a, a model they redesigned and added whatever they could to it. No, I think you mean more repurposed? Yeah, repurposed. Like, it probably was a war machine to begin with. Unless, uh, yeah, it, it could be repurposed or remodeled. Yep, that one went under its shoulder. Okay, yeah, we'll, we're, we're going to need to find some more stun ammo at this rate. Yeah. Also, do take this note. This is the only robot we've seen with a mouth. Yeah. Or the only model. Um, I'm not seeing any stun ammo around. Don't tell me we accidentally picked up all of it earlier. That we're now just completely out. That would be a horrible design, if that's what the case. Yeah, I'm presuming there's at least one that's supposed to respawn when we get one low. Come here, puppy. Come here. All I want to do is pull your leg a bit. Or a lot. Okay. okay, it's not happy with us at all, huh? It, it actually seems to go faster now that it's, now it's missing a leg. I want to say probably pro from all the rage and adrenaline, but we probably don't have any of those. But it does seem to have slowed down suddenly. Uh, ow. Actually, no need to run. Okay, now we run. Or fly. Uh, Enemies out oh, there. Okay, pretty sure that it wasn't there before. Uh, 
to say good morning about 12 minutes <laughs> it gave me the, the, the wake up slap okay down boy and stay down this time I don't know what will happen if we let it count down on that Oop. I don't think we want to. Okay, I think I think that was that focus strike. How I pulled that off, I don't know. Yep. Okay. <laughs> that got mucked up a bit because we were too close here. But I, th I think we pretty much pulled out a good chunk of its spinal cord there. Uh, holy. Yeah, monkey ain't monkeying around with this shit. Has it worked? Yes. chance you will come back somehow escape the slavers and make your way home so in case that day comes I'm recording this message for you just to say this it's a blessing for me at this moment to know you're alive I love you Tripp I said, get me home. I'll set you free. <sighs> I guess I lied. The slavers come from the West, so that's where we're going. I want to find out who did this. And then I'm gonna kill him. A wasteland. Monkey. You haven't said anything to me. About what? About how I broke our deal? To let you go? Well, what do you expect me to say? You get home. You find your whole life wiped out. You want to hit back. I get it. Everything is simple to you, isn't it? It just is what it is. And now we start the true odyssey to the west. Shoot at him, he's fumble from behind. It was a factory. Back in the war, they built mechs here. Huge ones. And what are we doing here? Looking for someone. Who? An old friend of my father. This is where he lives. I think he might be able to help us. If he's still alive. And they might have killed the dog as well. 
Oh, you didn't notice that dog head by the post? I did, yeah. Okay. Also, the the the, 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 the info bit there the earlier. Here. It's poisonous from mech fuel. Good to know. Uh, yeah, so, we got the... this friend of your father's. How's he gonna help us? To find Pyramid, we're gonna need to follow one of the slave ships, and I think there's only one way to do that. He has a flying vessel. Yes, it's how he would transport salvage to us. I just have to persuade him to let us use it. And how are you gonna do that? I haven't figured that part out yet. But yeah, the shielded, the, the bit it said about shielded enemies being vulnerable from behind, I didn't actually know Next. that. Wait here. I'll scan. But we did get to see a bit of, of that them. happening in one of the no fights. Way. There's two. There's no way forwards from here. There is. We're actually on a path he made for people to visit him at the factory. I've been here a couple times. Put that switch up there. Beware of Hog, Jay. I was to guess, are we meant to meet the uh, Hog poor pig uh, guy that is like... I don't know the entire story to your interest. I see many moves, the reason moves based on it, but each are by heavily based on it, still very different from each other. To the point I don't know, well, what exactly the original is supposed to be at this point. <laughs> yeah. All clear. So, okay. have, so my, the only things I know consistently about the West is, uh, yes, one human, one monkey, one pig, and I think there's one more, but I forgot what it's supposed to be. Uh, yeah, I forget as well at the moment. <laughs> Uh, mm -hmm. uh, at the very least, it typically has Sun Wukong, the Monkey King, a priest, who is the one who is actually originally undertaking the well, journey to the west. Uh, how do we get up there? Yeah, and we have the, the board, priest with us Oops. and the monkey. Monkey here. And we're about to meet the Og, if this makes sense with this place. So I Not guess here. we know who the next one is later. Okay. Yeah, we, um, almost launched off the edge there. Yep. <laughs> Monkey uh, team posing for dominance for a second. For a few seconds and say that you did several times. If I remember right? There should be a boat around here somewhere. We can use the boat to get through the tunnels. That's okay, that just caught me off guard. <laughs> <sighs> but yeah, the moments when games catch you off guard are here. the best, huh? Yep. <laughs> okay, what? No, it was Trip doing a pose and Monkey just telekinetically. <laughs> okay. Uh, I think there was an animation error there. Yeah. What's with all the big stuff? I think that'll make sense when you meet him. And the, the music, how will that make sense? Of that, I... I can't tell you. That was music. Yes, the boat is here just got one problem how do we get to it let me scan and of course there's mix just three though any defects no defects except and of course there's a one overlooking see if you can lower that section of machinery Okay, weaken the joints. Enemy. I still wonder if there was a 
make war between uh, several countries, like a World War III mech war, if you get what I mean there. Mech warriors, you may say. Yeah. And do, during the other chaos, something probably happened. Yeah, could just as well be that one country attempted to hack <clears throat> the, the mechs of another, but instead they uh, you know, hack or disrupt them with a virus to turn on their yeah, uh, their own. And yeah, just things went bad from there. Mm -hmm. I mean, several things happened at once. They just made everything go to absolute this. hell. What do you think, considering what I heard, what originally meaning of hell was? Hell. Uh, it's basically an old word for garbage heap. <laughs> I think I'd seen s some documentary or something about people trying to investigate the possible realities of the Bible's uh, stories and such. And I think one of the... Maybe that's per se conclusions they came to, but one of the ideas of... Okay, that was under a lot of pressure. One of the hypotheses they had was that the original hell was just a valley that was used as a garbage dump that got caught fire. Yeah, the, yeah I heard that one. Except the fire part, unless I forgot that part. But yeah, Good. It, it had evolved over the years since the original meaning of it. And I think the people said it wouldn't make sense because you know how they describe hell in some parts, but you kind of does sound like a way you organize a uh, garbage heap, even th during those times. It's it been a bit since we've done this. And the, the whole the whole Circles of Hell thing was only a relatively recent thing, like in the... Hmm, somewhere in the medieval era or something that that started with Dante's Inferno. I don't think anyone ever talked about Circles of Hell before that. Right? Hmm. I need to look up when that was again. Or when Dante's Inferno was written. Let's go before more mechs turn up. I'll drive. Give me the gun. Is that Kool-Aid? The gun has a light attachment. Got it. Yes. Yeah, you know, 1300... The, the 14th century, so the 1300s. Backtrack, backtrack. <laughs> She's not wrong like this. On all of those. Something doesn't feel right. We've got Max in here. Loon. Get ready on that gun. Hey, Loon. This one comes with Loon the zoom. can do a lot to one's men mentality. Yeah. And being alone forces you to be resourceful. It's a good thing that these stupid things have laser sights, which makes them really easy to spot. Okay. Too bad this thing is as slow as molasses. But this should be pretty doable, since they actually, oh, they actually go down quite quick from these shots. I yeah, say we'll we lose like a, an eighth of our health. <laughs> uh, yeah, this quote-unquote water looks more like it's, well, 
60 to 70 percent oil from the discolorations and such. But I did say it was heavily and poisonously polluted by mechdew. Yeah. So it's probably more than just oil. Sounds if that's mm. oil, it what was probably happened? be a different color. Cut out. Well, fix it. I'm trying. Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty sure even just a a big heaping of of oil wouldn't make the water this color of yellow. What do you mean? Gray, red, Sir, yellow, green, yeah. orange, a little bit purple if you can see. Yeah, those, those do happen when you when light refracts off or re, light re, reflects off oil. But I don't know about yellow. Go, go, go! Uh, yellow is there. Now, uh, yes. if, if that typically shows up in oil spills and such. Uh, they can, but not in this extent. Like, it's more like a sliver of yellow, you can see. Then it goes a little bit rainbowy. Uh, so to me, it I, looks I mostly think... yellow and red, depending on the lighting. Yeah, I. I'm not sure what this is made of. What is made of? Definitely have uh, mixed things with rust and whatnot. They're everywhere. Okay, okay yeah. folks, don't drink it. Definitely. But you know, other way, I would say probably don't even get close. Uh, that too, for it could be toxic to breathe in, and uh, let's not forget, if this is for you, there's a risk it's flammable. Definitely, yeah. This makes this area extremely dangerous to be in. I'm going to presume it's at least 50-50 fuel and water, because otherwise any of those mech bullets would have set all of this off already. Okay. But still, yet yeah. <laughs> liquids to stay away from. Chapter one: this stuff. Uh, anyway, being said, it does look like a mech boy's paradise. Yeah. This is an anti-mech device. The scanner won't activate if organic matter passes through. It only reacts to mechs. Hmm. Okay, that's smart. Of course. That yeah. Then again, the first thing that passed the through one. was metal, so uh, the system might be a bit, a bit more temperamental than expected. And of course, there's freaking sea mines or fuel mines. I'm gonna guess something with the headband uh, has something that uh, can be mistaken for a AI or something. Uh, it, it also said no. No, but I, thought, I almost thought that it was one of the mines. No slaves, and well, it's a slave headband, modified or not. So it probably went off on that, and it just has uh, only one alert, uh, alert line. Mm -hmm. I can guess. Uh, oh yeah, we did see in the prison ship that uh, people with those uh, headbands were kind of forced in. Uh, sort of controlled. Yeah. Back in there, you. So it makes sense to have a defense against those sense. <laughs> yeah, they, they, you could have them work as spies and whatnot. Yeah. yeah. Poor things. Was, I'm pretty sure oh, you didn't need to speed it up that bad, monkey. Yeah, yeah they're being... Being a slave and forced being a spy and all that is horrible. Just slavery in general. Actually, no. Slavery at all is horrible. Yeah. Then again, the headbands are pretty obvious, so I don't think anyone could really pretend to be a spy whilst, we whilst wearing one. 
Unless you have a very big cat hood. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's the first thing they check on there, at least. <laughs> okay, monkey, you really don't have to destroy them this bad. Just pull out the aiming thing. <laughs> Come back to the boat. Oh, well. We're going to have to do a bit of explaining, though, when we, well, get to wherever we're headed for. Also, I only oh, just now yeah. noticed that the turret looked like the turret itself looks like a pig. <laughs> it mirrors our ears. Oh dear! Yeah, the one look at this. I feel like it's is definitely mixed with the fuel, water, and definitely rust and mud and muck. Yep. Yeah, and probably two centuries of bacteria as well. Okay, guessing we'll be safe behind this. So how are we actually gonna find this guy? I don't know. I'm sort of hoping he'll find us. Well, after the amount of noise we made, I'm pretty sure he knows we're here. Probably, yeah. Uh... <laughs> and, uh, yeah, he is, a. Uh... Very peculiar. <laughs> he is very persistent with the pig aesthetic, huh? Okay, hold on. Just get this junk out of the way. Yeah, just look at it. It's, <laughs> it's a bit of a stretch, but yep. Oh, be here. And of Angry course, it's, it's part hog as well, as in <laughs> motorcycle. <laughs> You've seen another mm. one of those things, haven't you? <laughs> it's getting worse. It must be driving you crazy. <laughs> you know, I thought I was going crazy, but uh, not anymore. You were right. It's the headband. It's tuning me into something else. Yep. Oh, Got crap. Oh, stop that thing being there! I guess we found the guard dog. Help! Help! Yes, yes, we're coming. coming. No, oh, come on. Okay. Was the game first death? Seen another one of those Maybe not the first, <laughs> but the first from that at least. Actually, actually, yeah, I think I was, that was the first. Yeah, not combat death either. Okay, gotta keep up with this thing. Yeah. I'm pretty sure we'll be more than noticed after all of this. Hurry, Monkey! Do it now! It's nearly on me! Hurry! Go! Oh. <laughs> Bad doggy. <laughs> okay. Say so. You're gonna turn very slow. Any tricks? I'm gonna light you up. Now turn. Trip? Is that you? Oh, Pigsy! Pigsy! <laughs> Are you here alone with her? Where's your father?
No words needed. The Titan Factory. Cool sort of things are called Titans. We're gonna follow a slave ship west to find out who's behind all of this. And then what? Then I'm gonna kill him. It'll be dangerous, maybe even suicide, but. To save your breath, Trap. I'm in. It'll help us. You're in trouble, I'm there. And anyway, what's all this talk about suicide? Taking on the slavers is no different from any other fight. It's all a question of having the right weaponry. Yeah. <laughs> oh. That ship that nearly grabbed you, it's been coming here to the crater area every day for the past six months. I, I couldn't figure out why. So I started to keep track of what they were taking. Oh, yeah. And piece by piece, I started to put it together. You said weaponry. What weaponry? Rude. The Leviathan. At least that's what I call it. This thing I think they're making. A mega mech. The biggest ever created. With that kind of weaponry, you could take out anyone you wanted. So we wait for the salvagers to come back tomorrow and follow them in your flying ship. Exactly. But before we can fly, I'm gonna need some spare parts. Luckily, I know precisely where they are. We're looking for a distributor, a heat sink, a supercharger, and a power cell. So, this is where we'll find the distributor. You better stay here, Trip. It's a bit of a tricky climb. Man's work. Are you up to it? <laughs> Come on, it's this way. And of course, Pixie's a bit of a slob and a sleaze, judging from his quarters and yeah. that belt. It's all the way up there. I don't, but I don't get what it is. How has he been able to eat enough to become how she is? He is. I mean. Hey, so how about we make this more interesting? Interesting. Mm -hmm. You want to race to the top? You ready? Three, two, one, go! I'm guessing he grows a ton of mushrooms. Uh, I was to guess he would be able to trade for a lot of food, considering he trades scraps in the other hey. colony. Hey, that's cheating! See you at the top! And, yeah, also that. He doesn't really need to move too much if he has a grappling hand. Careful now. You're gonna love the next bed. Is that all you got, big boy? <laughs> big boy. <laughs> okay. Oh, watch that big <laughs> Hey, you've done this before, obviously. <laughs> Is how you spend your time? It's not how you keep fit, that's for sure. <laughs> oh, come on, just a little freaking corner. <laughs> hey, how'd you do that? <laughs> it's for me to know and you to find out. <laughs> Dick. Oh, I can't believe I'm doing this. Glad you enjoyed yourself down there. Oh. <laughs> Down there, you say? Hey. Come on. Uh, come on. Hey, I thought you wanted a race. <laughs> oh, yeah, pretty, pretty fast for a pig. Yeah, he's real or something. I, I keep forgetting. I, 
Mm. Only people that eat a lot of food are people who train a lot. <laughs> Beat you. One. How'd you do that? <laughs> Just for a second, I thought you had me. I only lost on account of my bad arm. All right. If it hadn't been for that, I'd have, I'd have left you for dust. Uh -huh. <laughs> Very clearly, last time I lost to him. I just need to stop a moment to catch my breath. So, we haven't been properly introduced, Pixie. Now, Pixie, how did you pick up a name like that? Having a clue. How about you? What's your name? Monkey. Monkey. <laughs> ah, monkey. Yeah. Yes, that's kind of obvious. Like you smell me better. Great. Oh, dang it, I just realized. You're soon out of time. Yeah. <laughs> okay, with how much rope there's in the thing, I think Batman might, might get jealous of that grapple. Okay. Uh, we're not making that jump. Thank you. A bit more weight, uh, monkey, than you thought, Pixie. Not, not that way. There we go. <laughs> okay, we should be close to a checkpoint at least, though. Yeah, I was to say three checkpoints. Won the race. I did. <laughs> no, you didn't. Sure. Trip, I won. <laughs> this way to the supercharger. Follow me. Okay, we'll just have to keep an eye out for any saving icon. I'm guessing it would appear in the upper right, since, well, that's the most clear at the moment. Let's mean I'll be able to focus a bit less on the rest. Huh? Have you spoke to the saving icon once? I... We've heard that sound a few times. I think that might be a notifier of a checkpoint. Okay. On the other side of this door is the actual mech factory. That's where we'll find a supercharger and a heat sink. I'll get this open. Okay. <clears throat> Hello. The heck are these? There's just decorative there's lights. Plan. There's a supercharger on that platform. There's a problem. There's some very strong mech signatures up there. To reach it, all we need to do is raise these two walkways. If you raise the walkways, I can hang back with this baby. When the mechs come out, I'll start dropping while you go hand to hand. Let's do it. Okay, let's get the first walkway up. Yeah. Okay, monkey. Turn it on. Okay. Up we go. Yeah. Even if we're not that close to a checkpoint. It's too far to jump. Throw me across. <clears throat> it typically that it it wouldn't take too long to really catch up. 
And yeah, that was this yeah, that was the stream timer. So let's have a little check where this last checkpoint is then. If it was at the door or just there, then we know that this noise is Okay, close enough. Here's the plan. Okay, that's good. There's a super chart. Okay. It makes sense as the checkpoint be the video uh scenes as well. Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> well, that'll be it for today's stream of Enslaved Odyssey to the West. And I'm trying to remember how long the rest of the game takes. I think we might be able to finish the game in the next stream. Definitely in the one after that, though. <clears throat> yes, yeah, so either one or two more, basically. Yeah. Okay. If I understand this right. Yeah, for now, though, let's head on over here and we go look for someone to raid before we end the stream. So let me move this over here and change the screen share to it uh, there and there. OK, ta -ta -ta. now let's have a look at who are online. We have Starnak, who is just chatting. Let's see, working on stream things and chatting. OK. Isaiah Rozier, who is streaming Pseudo Regalia. Kiri Natsuyoko, who is playing Old School RuneScape. Ruffle Raccoon is playing Star Wars The Old Republic. Oh, this is a new one. Kena is playing Zero CVN. Let me double check that everything is muted. Yep. What is this? Top Down Tarkov Stalker? Question marks. Okay. Right. Hmm. Could be interesting. Uh, next, we have Horatius the Dwarf with Lethal Company. Then we have Rogue... Uh, okay, that'll be it. <laughs> because the, <laughs> the next one has 200 plus viewers and, well, we prefer to keep it to below 100. Uh, other, otherwise, I think it would look, look like we're trying to clout uh, surf or something. <clears throat> but yeah. Uh, any of those sound interesting, or shall I pick, or look at the recommendeds? Hmm. I try to think of who we have been raiding in a very long time. Hmm. Let's see. Didn't we do Rocky recently? I think so. Hmm. I know we did Hisai a lot for a while, but I'm not, not sure when we did them last time. I think last time we raided them, they were still playing Dave the Diver, which we with with which we should do a, a continue for the, the new story bits and such. Also with Dredge, since that got its DLC now. I haven't seen an episode yet, but I did see it recommended to be on YouTube, and I saw it had a episode one and one hour long. As I said, a episode number on video, I'm gonna guess it's more than just a one hour content. Okay, I thought I saw something interesting among the recommended, but I I recognize that as a mobile game that <laughs> Captain Sauce has played every so often. So let's but see. But I do love watching him play it for the commentary. Yeah, the cut down stuff. Because otherwise, games like that require just hundreds of hours of grind. <clears throat> or as he does, yeah. uh, paying for stuff. But yeah, he, he can afford that. <laughs> yeah, and he had said that, that many times he doesn't show the grind. And comment that only grind up all times. And apparently he might be able to upload videos more regular again. Uh, for we able to read in his comments, many repeated the sim same or similar phrases that seem to hint that he... Uh, okay, this is a guess that he might have had eye surgery? Yeah, you said something about that earlier. I've not seen anything about that myself. Could be that it was mentioned in... Uh community notes or on Twitter or something. Yeah, one of the videos said that he posts many of those video comments on Twitter. Uh, this all we were able to gather from the comments and many repeated that, like, don't, 
glad that you have mentioned you're going to try to uh, yeah. return to regular sketch clue just don't overstrain your eyes many repeated don't overstrain your eyes this make me guess maybe eye surgery or something eye related yeah and i just realized i forgot to put the freaking loop on the background music so give me a sec on that properties uh i can remove that from that loop there we go okay yeah <laughs> uh let's see i think we raided k9 somewhat recently so shall we go give uh hisaya rosier a visit then You can practically hear the gears turning in his head. What? I said yes. Yep, yep. <laughs> okay, the mic didn't pick it up then, or I just didn't hear myself. I'm okay. a little surprised. <laughs> okay. Slash, raid, and paste. But before we start that, of course, thank you everyone who has been watching now or later. Uh, I see something. I see someone uh, different has been uh, <clears throat> lurking in the chat for a bit. Hey there, Lance. And uh, yeah, if things go well, then in about three hours, uh, two hours, 50 minutes about, uh, <clears throat> we'll, we should have a second stream today of the Sexy Brutale, which will be our third stream of that, I think. I think we'll still get one more out of that game. Um, yeah, looking yeah, forward I'm, to it already. I'm trying to remember the end game of that, but yeah. <clears throat> uh, either way, though, for now, let's get the great started. And uh, yeah, thank you all again for watching. I, I forgot, I forgot someone. Thank you as always, Drakir. You're welcome as always, but forget full friend and be safe, everyone, and see you all soon again. <laughs> yeah, thank you all again for watching, and until next time, have a nice day, and until then. Be safe all, and watch out for me mechanized seagulls. <laughs>